Hey you guys, welcome back to another sweetest vlog. We are officially moved into our new house. It was a crazy two days. Y'all already know how moving goes. I have yet to organize the studio because I want to save that for y'all. The main house wasn't too exciting. Nothing was like very new, like all the old furniture we've had from our previous houses. So I'll give you like a mini tour of it after this. Oh, also. If you can't hear, it's raining, thunderstorming, and Della is terrified of thunder. Like she's just, she's like shaking. So she'll be here with us. Mackers was in here too yesterday and he loved it. He's in the main house right now, just chilling. But right now, I have some fun things to unbox and then a really fun thing to work on in the studio. So let's get to it. Okay, so I got some towels because Pottery Barn, if you didn't know, has a collaboration with Love Shack Fancy. And these towels were on sale. You know, I had to swipe them up. I think they were originally like 60 bucks each. And now they were $25, so I got two towels to go into the studio. Oh shoot, okay, this is the bigger one. I got three. I got this huge towel because I'm going to the beach in a few weeks. We're going to Florida. And here is just this beautiful Love Shack Fancy Pottery Barn. I actually think this was the kids section that I found it in. But yeah, she's beautiful, love, love, love. And then I think the other two towels are the same print. All right, here's the normal sized one. Oh, it's like little roughly. So cute. These will look gorgeous in the new bathroom. Okay, y'all already know what this one is. This is Love Chef Fancy. So I first got a shower curtain. This is from their newest home line. This is perfect because the bathtub that's in here has the brack, like the shower rod above it and it's round because it's like an old bathtub. Oh my gosh, I love this print, this is so cute. So we will put this up in a minute. Okay, and then y'all, I got some wallpaper. I got the peel and stick wallpaper. I got two rolls. I really don't know how much I need. I'm just gonna choose like a random wall and start there because I wanna have different wallpapers for every wall so then every section of the room is like a new photo shoot backdrop, you know what I'm saying? So here are the two wallpapers and we will also be putting that up together today. And I'm doing that by myself, so we'll see how that goes. I got a shabby chic bed comforter. I feel like this is a great alternative if you don't want to spend it on Love Shack Fancy. This one I think was like 50 bucks for a king size bed comforter. And it comes with two pillowcases, like pillow shams. And I was gonna do Love Shack Fancy, but I was like, I don't feel like spending like $300 on this. So I'm like, let's support Shabby Chic. And we'll go with this one. Again, on Amazon, Shabby Chic actually has like a whole storefront on Amazon. So go check that out. Okay, let's see. Okay, this is 30 square feet, 20 and a half inches by 18 feet. That means nothing to me. I have no idea. <laughs> I need to measure the walls. But let's just see how much, and then I can kind of like eyeball it where I want it to go. Ooh, here we go. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh my gosh. It's more baby pink in person than I thought. I thought it'd be a brighter pink, but I'm so glad it's more of a subdued pink. Oh gosh, okay. How do I do this? Okay, y'all, it's a mess in here. We're, we're rolling with it. But okay, I really envisioned the wallpaper to go on that wall. I don't know if we'll have enough. I feel like maybe I'm being a little bit too ambitious. But this actually looks like a lot of wallpaper and I have two rolls. Or maybe this wall would be easier. Ooh, okay. We're gonna do this wall. Okay. Wish me luck. I'm gonna just say that done is better than perfect. We're not going for perfection here. It's by myself. Okay, let's do it. I'm bored to death on the job. I'm sick of walking this dog. It's like I live in a fog. Tonight I want something new. I feel the need to get rude. I'm tired of watching the tube. She is absolutely not perfect. She has a lot of like little air bubbles, but I was like, oh my God, I just, I did the best I could. And I still think she looks pretty good. There's like some 
It was just so hard to get certain areas, like right here, there's like air bubbles, but I really just don't care. I think overall, it looks good, especially for me just doing it by myself. But I ran out of wallpaper. And I refused to buy another roll because I think they were like 140 each or something. Maybe a little cheaper. I don't know, but either way, that's not cheap for wallpaper. So I'm just gonna try and get creative with this space. I think I'm gonna hang this curtain and kind of just like make it a little whimsical, add a vine of flowers, try to make it look less weird. But I just refuse to buy another roll for just one, for one like space. I don't know, let's see how this goes. <laughs> Okay, y'all, it is the next day, and my bed frame is here. We got her right here. She's from Amazon. It came within like three days, and I'm so excited to put it together. I'm determined to do it myself because I know I can. All right, this is it. Don't mind all the trash bags and all that, but I envision the bed to go here. This is gonna have to move, but I just wanna see like how wide this goes, and yeah, let's get to it. There's just some little things that I want to clean up. I have a mess behind me, so let's clean this up, kind of organize it. Y'all, I haven't even gotten to the organization part. <laughs> I still need to go through all of this and wait for it. All of this, like, this is kind of scary. All right, let me clean up this a bit and then I'm gonna give you the full reveal of the studio so far. Okay, here is the reveal of the studio so far. So this is the little kitchenette area. We're waiting for appliances still. I still have to like organize stuff, but here's the couch from the cottage. I just put some comforters and blankets on it for now. But here is the overview. It is not done yet. Like I still have so many more things to do. This is the steaming ironing section for all my creations that are going to be dropping soon. And over here is my workspace. Still need to organize everything, but I have my sewing and embroidering machine and all the clothes and such. And I just have a random desk over here with some random stuff. The bathroom's in there. And then here is the reveal of the bed. So I'm waiting for the canopy hook to come in today. I just kind of like tied something on for now just to see the vision, but I need to move it over so it's aligned with the bed frame and the picture. And I plan on putting this picture up and the third picture up right here so the wall is not so bare. And then I decided to hang a bunch of flowers and the curtain on this. And I feel like it looks a little less weird let me know if you have any other suggestions on what to do with this wall because I refuse to buy another roll of this. But the wallpaper actually looks so good. I'm very proud of myself. And all of these are from Shein, Ikea. The bed frame is from Amazon. All my pillows are from Shabby Chic or Love Shack Fancy. And then I found this at an antique mall. And then I found that vase at an antique mall another antique mall, like everything is usually just like thrifted or antiques or from 
Love Shack Fancy or Shabby Chic. And yeah, there's the reveal of this part of the studio. She's got a long way to go, but I think she looks great for only being in here for like two days. And then here's the bathroom. I love how the shower curtain looks. So cute. We have a very fabulous water heater in here. But yeah, this bathroom needs to be cleaned, so don't mind that. That curtain is from Shabby Chic on Amazon. Go check it out. And then I got these from Amazon. And yeah, that's, that's the reveal. Okay, let me give you an overview of what our living room situation looks like. And I apologize for the background noise. We have people cutting our lawn right now. Okay, there's still so much clutter that we need to clean up and that vanity we need to get rid of. But here is what the like little dining room situation looks like. And here is our living room. I'm really liking our couch. We got it off Amazon and it's actually really comfy and it was a really good price on Amazon and the little corner and we're just still getting stuff together but she's really coming together hi mackers look at this little baby hey bubs the bedroom is still looking a little rough but she's getting there again just stuff everywhere but y'all i hung up all my clothes and yesterday the closet completely collapsed so i've had to like rearrange things i'm very blessed and lucky to have all these closet spaces but yeah that's this is what we're working with so far and yeah and outside this window you can see that our patio got done we have a little fire pit okay i am going to wrap up today's video thank you guys so much for watching i love and appreciate you so much remember to be sweet love yourself and you will have it all and i will see you in the next sweetest vlog